Hello, this is Mr. Nihilus74, and today I am going to show you how to let me exit out of this so I can bring up a new one. In the FIFA editor tool, I'm going to show you how you can add a superstar x-factor to a player who does not have it. And I'm going to be using uh, Jimmy Garoppolo from the 49ers. So this is our FIFA editor tool, uh, the latest version. First thing I'm going to do in this little search box here, I'm going to type in player and what we need to do is we need to find the player's information. Let's see, where did I find that at? Content, football character. I don't think that's the right one. We want just characters. And then we want player and then players. Now under players, you see all these folders uh, with with uh, letters and that's that's for their names, their last names in alphabetical order. So I'm going to click on G for Garoppolo and we see Garoppolo Jimmy underscore one zero eight six six right here. So that that's the only thing we need. We need to make sure that we have this name exactly as they have it listed. And what I'm gonna do is I've already done it, is notate the name exactly how they have it listed. Underscore 10866. So that's all we need for that. So we're going to close up all these folders. The next thing that we need to find is we need to type in base rouster, all one word, base rouster abilities. But abilities is a second word. So we search for that, and then it says it's under Global, D-Sub, In-Game, Football Abilities, Ability Associations. So we click on Ability Associations, and we see Base Rouster Abilities right here. So I'm going to double click that, and it brings up Base Rouster Abilities for us and string ability map items, 115 items. That is all of the players that have the Superstar X Factor ability. We click the little arrow next to that to bring down the list for us. All these little numbers are different players with Superstar X Factor abilities. So if we click on number 12, we interestingly enough that's Tom Brady. And we got his name listed here, Brady Tom underscore 1327. Entity ability data for Tom Brady. And this is all his special abilities. Inability entity ability data. Active abilities. Passive abilities and we can see all the superstar abilities listed for him. What I'm most interested in is the extra hot routes QB. So Jimmy Garoppolo doesn't have any superstar abilities. So what I'm going to need to do is add him to this list. Right now they say there's 114 
uh, players on here. So I'm going to scroll all the way to the top and uh, for string ability map items 115 items I'm going to click on the plus and then if I scroll all the way down they added 115 115 so there's no information in here so for name I want to copy my Garoppolo Jimmy underscore 10866 and you just copy it like any kind of text and then you click here next to his name and just paste it in you can right click and paste it in or you can go control V whatever you need to do uh, entity ability data so I'm going to click this little arrow here so we see that he has no abilities listed no special abilities listed so what I'm going to do is copy the abilities from Tom Brady and put them in here start and you just right click the ability click copy remember which one it's under so we see that's under entity ability data activate logic so we're gonna paste that in the same place here and you just go where it says null right click on it and then click paste and it pastes it in there for you and I'm gonna do that with the rest of them and then active abilities for Tom Brady under active abilities highlight open wide receivers so I'm going to right click that and click copy and then I'm going to scroll down and then for my new entry for Jimmy Garoppolo there's nothing there zero items so we need to go over here and click the little plus and then it puts a little arrow next to active abilities we click that and then underneath it we see it says null so we're gonna right click the null and click paste highlight open receivers and you have to make sure that you put the right abilities in the right place and then the next we're gonna do passive abilities first one I'm going to do is the hot routes one because that's the most important to me and we see that listed under the passive abilities and Tom Brady's the only one that comes with it by default so we have our passive abilities zero items so we're going to need to click plus and then it puts our little arrow next to that and then we got the first one here null and we're going to paste that in and you can try different abilities from different quarterbacks and put them in there like from Patrick Mahomes, Josh Allen, uh, Russell Wilson, Joe Burrow, whatever ones you like. Next one I'm going to do is conductor because that's an important one to me. That allows you to do audibles and hot routes quicker than you would normally. So there's only one item listed under passive abilities so we'll need to click the plus and then for the null click on paste to add that in there and I guess I'll add other ones they're not as important to me but while I'm here throw power boost on precision passing feet set so we'll copy that one And I'll need to click the plus again to add and if you want to take one away you just click the X next to it immune to pressure in pocket 
So we'll do that one. Plus, no, paste. All right. So we got that in there. And then the next line we see player description. And you can basically type whatever you want in here. Just a short little comment, whatever you feel about that player is a good description. I'm just going to type in great QB. And then we have the player image index. And you're supposed to put a number in there for an image of the player. And it, it, would, it would put this image where on when you look on the superstar X factor ability screen in the game it would put this picture for the player in there I don't really have a no in any numbers for any pictures of Jimmy Garoppolo right now like I could put one in there for another player and and it would put their picture in there but I'm just gonna leave that at zero right now it's enabled in Pro Bowl and enabled in Beta. I don't think they matter too much, but uh, I checked them anyways. So that's everything that we need to do uh, for the player that we added. So now what I'm going to do is export this as a mod file so I can use it. And we'll just call it... Uh, Garoppolo Jimmy underscore one zero eight six six. We'll put SFX. We'll say one point one. One point one. And I'm going to copy this because it's going to ask me to name the file and then I'm going to click save and this is a folder where I put most of my mods that I created I'm going to make sure that there isn't one with this name already so it doesn't save over it or there's no confusion on it or anything okay so I'm going to go ahead and save that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and exit out of here. And then I'm going to bring up my mod manager. I'm going to remove this one. There's another one I was messing around with. But I'm going to put a new one in there just so you can see how it works. So I'm going to click on import mods and we see let's see was that the one that I named it I named it 1.1 I thought I named it SFX 1.1. Maybe I did name it 1.0. Let me check just to make sure if it's in the folder or not. Maybe I saved it in the wrong folder. Oh, it didn't save as the right kind of mod. Is what it didn't it didn't do. I'm gonna change the name of this real quick. Let's see if it'll save correctly. It's because I put that 1.1 in there. Made it save wrong. There, there it is. Once hopefully it'll work after doing all that. So made it a mod file. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it and open it. And there it is right here. So I'm going to click on it. Click on apply mod. 
it's got the check mark on there. We always want to make sure it has the check mark. And then we're going to click launch. And then it's going to launch the game for us. just for when I mess around with these mods. EA Sports, it's in the game. So we got the game loaded up. First thing I'm going to do is go over here to uh, Rousters and Playbooks. And I'm going to click on View Superstar X Factors. We got all, a list of all the Superstar X Factor players. I'm going to go down to the 49ers. All right, so we see Jimmy Garoppolo's on the list. I don't think he was on the list at all before. And we see that he's got the Pro Reads, he's got Hot Route Master, he's got Conductor, Six Feet Lead, Fearless. And you see how the image of, of him, it's just a generic image. And that's because I left it as zero, and I didn't know what image number to put in there. Maybe that's something I'll be able to figure out later. So what I'm going to do now is play a game with him and make sure that the Superstar X Factor works. I'm going to delete this game. Custom game. We're going to go down to the 49ers. The other team will probably get the ball first, so I'll either I'll try to let them score right away so I get the ball back. all this good stuff. See, I should kick it short just so they can get a better return and score faster. I just want to get the ball back. They didn't like that. going to go goal line and blitz everybody. I'm either going to sack them all or they're going to get smart and throw a short pass and score a touchdown so that I can get the ball back real quick. There he goes. Crowd did not like that. Playing with their emotions.
hot routes. All right, so we got the extra hot routes. Awesome. Posts. Got the Texas route for the running backs and all that other stuff. Awesome. I'm going to leave him where he is. All right, so let's see how good this play works. Looting the pressure. Didn't throw good under pressure. Alright, flat routes. I didn't notice those before. Passing play. All right. Use check. Inbounds. Uh, so we see the hot routes work, and which is great because now I can just play exhibition games uh, with the. I can add the hot route master to, to the quarterbacks. Uh, you you were only able to do it in a franchise mode through the game without a mod before, and only played them with the uh, franchise mode. But now you can do it in exhibition games. Uh, I'm going to be trying to develop this mod further and uh, adding it to more players so there's more choices and uh, I'll probably have a mode mod somewhere where people can download it soon. Uh, I have to go to work soon and when I get off work I'll probably work on this further. Uh, I hope you watched this, enjoyed this video and uh, please watch the rest of my videos like and subscribe. Thank you.